Andre the Giant. Andre. Andre was a good personal friend, a good family friend. Uh, a lot of people didn't know that uh, he was godfather to my two daughters. I didn't know that. And, uh, you know, like a lot of guys in my era, a lot of them passed away. We've had uh, four or five guys this past two months, you know, Bruno, and a good friend of mine, Big Bill and UC. You know, uh, it's just sad. It makes you appreciate every day. Every day. Yeah. Yeah. Well, about Andre, I want to ask you. Now, everybody has a story about Andre, num or numerous stories about uh -huh. Andre. Do you have a story that somebody wouldn't know? Oh, I don't know if I have a story they wouldn't know. But we used to go to Japan quite a bit. We were tag partners, we were opponents, and we were tag partners again over 14 years. We'd go about eight weeks a year. And uh, everybody knows that he used to like to drink a little bit. <laughs> but in Japan, they've got the small calves. And uh, he would hide behind a pillar outside of the hotel or the restaurant. And I'd flag down the cab and I'd take my time getting there. And they'd open the door and Andre would lumber in and jump in and take the whole back seat. Of course, the Japanese cab driver didn't want him in there, but would slam the door shut. So his butt was in one window and his head was in the other window. <laughs>